Hi, my name is Sarah O'Toole. I am the director of Go Away Actors Workshop and I also teach different courses um, as, as, as part of the program. Um, we are also expanding classes to Ennis at the moment, which is very exciting. We've done one term there with a beautiful group and we'll be going back there this term. And we are also starting to deliver classes to young adults which we are also very excited about. I've been running Go Actors Workshop for 10 years. We started off, I started off, I guess, as a, a, a humble evening acting workshop for adults in the Anno Santo Hotel back in 2009. And um, 10 years on, we're delivering a, a range of, 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 of classes in different areas, different skills, different levels, and working with some of Galway's most um, exciting theatre professionals, people I really admire, so it's wonderful to collaborate in that way. I like to think that our classes provide a, a space for people to create. Uh, I really, really love teaching techno. So my first job out of drama school was um, in Pride and Prejudice with The Gate, but uh, which was which is great. Um, but very quickly I realised I wanted to be a director. So I trained in theatre directing at Middlesex University. That course is now running in East 15. Um, and it, it was really interesting because you got to do each modules as um, month long, month long specialisations. So I did Shakespeare, I did comedy in London. I still love teaching comedy. Um, and then I went to Moscow to study Michael Chekhov. Uh, which has influenced my whole career, my whole way of approaching performance. And I, I, I still love to, to work with Max Haffler, also based in Galway, on this sort of really beautiful, holistic, creative technique. And I also went to Bali to study Indonesian, or um, to study Indonesian theater, theater of the East it was called, um, which involved lectures during the day, going to the beach in the afternoon, and meeting, um, going into the homes and, and communities of the islanders and um, really, it was a really amazing experience. So I, I lived in Glasgow for a number of years and I ran a theatre company and a an comedy improv group called Raised Curtain, I did a lot of directing and acting and then in 2008 I came home, I got offered a job uh, teaching acting Michael Chekhov in uh, NYG where I taught for a number of years. I also taught playwriting, directing and Go Away Actors Workshop got set up as a means for me to earn a bit of pocket money and now it's, it's, it's really gratifying to see how it's grown. But at times I, I suppose it is hard to balance running, running a, a, an organisation like this with your own creative work. I've been working with my own company Anum for a number of years and most recently we did an adaptation of Ingmar Bergman's Persona. Um, I participated in Druid's Fuel program which was such an amazing experience. Uh, so I'm working on a play, a one woman show about, I suppose it's about mountaineering and, and, and about sort of, um, uh, how would you say, the gap between how when we feel low and we want to get high um, and using sort of partying and mountaineering is a metaphor for that. It's called Finding Galahad. So I, I've been kind of tinkering away with that and recently I've started exploring singing, which is a totally different field, but it's, it's, it's wonderful to have, it's always wonderful to have a creative outlet, whatever that is. So favorite acting tip, um, it's more of a concept than a tip, but use archetypes when approaching characters. So an archetype is a very specific image of a very specific type of energy um, and you can use your body as almost like a lightning conductor to access that energy. So say for instance if, if your character has a kingly quality, he doesn't necessarily need to be a king, but he could very much portray that character of king, then how do you use your body, say I'm sitting in a chair right now, to sort of create that. And then it sort of, it sort of fills your body up. Um, but I always try to use very, very different, find as many, three very opposing archetypes within the one character, so that gives them complexity. It's like thinking of painting with primary colours. If you paint with one colour, it'll be very flat, but if you really use different colours, you get a lot of depth and light and shade and, and I suppose complexity. Uh, so that is a positive um, tour of archetypes. Come to our classes and find out more. I was... 15 years old and I was hanging around the house and my mum was and I was like I'm born mom and she's like get out of this house go to town and don't come back until you're signed up for something and I went into town and it was summer but I went into the Goway Arts Centre and I looked up I put my name down for GYT and and um, I 
auditioned for it and I got in and and that was I suppose yeah that was that was it but I, it was just a hobby till that point and then one day when I was 17 my boyfriend at the time was watching Lawrence of Arabia on on TV and I was like what are you watching I want to go outside I want to do something but I suddenly got really into the film and I was just so riveted by Peter O'Toole's performance not because he has the same surname as me just but um uh, pure narcissist <laughs> no I was so riveted by the performance that um I think it was that complexity thing he which I was talking about the archetypes he wasn't he was a hero but he was not a hero and and there were so many different sides to him in one in one one embodiment. I was so fascinated and it made me feel like acting was something really worthwhile to do.